Don't the Hip Hop Matrix sh- show right about now. It's time for that cash out. My girl Mia, Mia, what you got? Lil Wayne has no worries, I ain't got no worries, about bullshit-ass Birdman. And I quote, if you think that I am stressing or letting this shit get to me, please remember there's too much good poo-na-na and too many great MF and loyal fans to worry about any bullshit-ass Birdman. That's what he says. And, um, yeah, it just it, it makes me go silent. That was a moment of silence for the Carter Six. I don't think it's going to be released, I guess, ever. I, I don't know. I'm tired of that. Lil Wayne is supposedly prepping for multiple projects this year, including Velvet. So be on the lookout for that. Nicki Minaj, she recently surpassed Aretha Franklin as the woman with the most songs ever on Billboard Hot 100 charts. Nicki is at 76. The Queen of Soul falls at 73. Taylor Swift is at 70. So she's trying to catch up with Nicki now. Beyonce, Rihanna, they down in the 50, 55, 56 range. Just to give you an idea of how great of a feat this is. We can't talk about Lil Wayne and Nicki Minaj without talking about the big three. Drake is reportedly coming back with OG Ron C. If you're from the South, like your girl here is, you have heard about those mm, action series. Chopped and Screwed, I Cannot Wait. It's supposed to be titled mm, Action 69. That is a playlist that's going to be out this summer. And More Life has racked up more than 76 million streams. Do that, Drake. And like I said about Joey Badass, apparently he is suffering a case because he assaulted a man in L.A. back at an MTV event in September. There was like a Donald Trump, Hillary Clinton impersonator. Anyway, Joey Badass apparently jumped on the Donald Trump impersonator. Like, that hate for Trump runs so deep, man. Let's talk about it. Tell me how you really feel. Follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, at It's Mia. Thanks, yo, Hip Hop Matrix Show. Let go. Yeah.